Now I like to introduce the bamboo for you. In、uh, Chinese art, you it's best for you to learn how to paint the bamboo. And the bamboo leaves is look like this way. So when you paint the brush, you have to be like this shape. Now, and I、uh, start work on the mixing the color. It's very important. Always recycle. Go back, mixing, and use the tip to pick up the water and the ink. First level, you finish. Then mix the second. Now, I show you how to work on the basic first stroke of bamboo. Reverse, same pressure, down, up. That's how you work on the first brush stroke. And now you practicing on three stroke. Reverse pressure and up. Then reverse again. Right away you show the stem. Stem up, pressure and up. Make sure your three three piece of Leaves have the different angle. Now you work on fourth stroke. Fourth stroke have two different way. One way is two, three, four. The other way was the end of your、uh, branch, and you have to work on last stroke. That's how you work on the last stroke of four brush.、And、then now you move on fifth stroke. Center brush on top. Start it down, cross, and side. Yeah, make sure you remember how to work on this brush stroke, which it's started with one, coming down two. And come inside, third, coming cross, and four on the side and top. That's how you start with your brush stroke. And now, and show you how to work on the grooving. When you paint in grooving, you have use last fifth stroke first. Hold the brush tight. Move with your shoulder. This is five stroke. Then second group is four. Keep this way. Keep on, and then three group. Then you want have all this group being very tight. So make sure they are have a tight position. So that is how you design art, and this is the last group. So you have first group, first second group, third group, and this is the fourth group. After this fourth group, and you connect the branch together. When you painting, make sure you don't circle though, and then you from the beginning of branch you want to connect to your last stop. So this is main branch. Make sure you know where you going, and connect all the branch to the main branch. This is how you grouping together. Now I would like to show you how to work on your your、uh, stem. When you work on the stem, pick up the water. Take out in clean spot. Open your brush to the wide brush and flat. And when you take out like this, so your brush look like flat. And then now you come back, pick up your brush from the side to the side. So you have dark ink on the side. Mix again from the tip. Now 
That's how you work on your stem. Stop and stop, side check, side, vertical, on the side, up. Hold the brush very tight, pressure the same pressure, go up. That's how you work on the show you one more time. Stop, up, and check, and lay down. Up, push it up. Side, and pressure, up. That way, make sure hold the breath. After this, you work on your branch. When you work on the branch, have to go on the side to the side. It's the same thing, it's branch up a lot of joint, branch, and then go to the other side, opposite, to the next joint. Walk on your bamboo. Then keep it go up. And so to this side, you can add some branch. Always stop and go, stop and go. That's how to work on the bamboo branch. And last, pick up a dark ink and close your joint before they dry. I would like to show you on the side how to work on your joint. This is the way. Stop, check on the side, stop again, cross, and stop again and check. That's how you work on your joint. Now I like to show you how to work on the uh, bamboo, the whole picture of a bamboo. And uh, this uh, brush is same thing, clean first, or get wet. Then use your tip. Pick up a little bit of ink. If not enough, use the tip, pick up a little bit more water. Make sure it's get enough light ink. And mix side to side. Make sure your brush is mixed to the flat. Then pick up the dark ink from side to the side. You can see dark ink on the side and middle it have light ink. And then mix and mix again side. And then you come to the, the paper, use vertical position and work on the stem. The bamboo trunk. Hold it tight, pressure, enough pressure, and go. And stop, check. Now, it's used up all the water, so you come back, pick up a little bit more ink, and you want to work on the second stem again. mix. Now, hold it very tight and Now I make my brush to the tip, a very good tip. Then I use whatever I have, the leftover of ink on the plate. Then mix some light ink and bring branch out.
you don't have to make too much branch because the ink will take too much of and later you want to work on the on the leaves they will not show then on opposite side this way branch out first this one come out then next one we want to finish the join so pick up a little bit dark ink on the tip and then work on stop and go across use good energy before they dry now when you work on the the bamboo leaves you have to bring a lot of ink in the one time I almost soak in half half of ink in your brush then make sure you know where you want to go and work on quick position Now this is all the group being already done, then you move to the second group. Don't work on the all over the place. Make sure you start from the center of your bamboo branch. Your leaves have thick, skinny, fat. Or different sizes. Now this is a tight and this is loose. And pick up a little bit more water, will be lighter and push this brush to the background. Have to make sure work from outside the paper. So you pick up one time, you mix one time of your ink. You can paint in so many different strokes. You don't have to keep go back and dip the color. This is the whole picture, but it's not finished yet. Now we got to go back and uh, take care of a detail. Wash it off your all the dark ink. Use just right color, same branch, same color of branch. Then you connect all this little touch. together. Make sure this leaf is not grown top the air. It's connect on all this branch. This is how whole bamboo look like. 